Up is a company seeking to bring the latest beauty trends to America. Hello, sharks. My name is Sarah Lee, and I'm Christine Chang, and we're from New York City. We're the co-founders of Glow Recipe, and today we're seeking $425,000 in exchange for 10% equity in our company. Glow Recipe is here today to make every American woman's skin glow and make everyone look beautiful by bringing only the best products and skin secrets from the modern epicenter of advanced skin innovation, Korea. Korea. Sharks, did you know in the last year, the top U.S. beauty editors and media outlets have been crowning Korean beauty to be 12 years ahead of the rest of the world? With Glow Recipe, Korean beauty is no longer a hidden secret. We believe that Korean beauty can be the next big player in the U.S. Now, we know that being a shark isn't easy. You're stressed, sleep deprived, dealing with the pressures of being an apex predator. <laughs> We wanted to bring a little bit of glow into your day and onto your faces, so we have some samples for you. I hope it's whiskey. <laughs> Yay. Thank you, Robert. Thank, Thank you, ladies. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. So the first is a waterless mist that is packed with botanical extracts for extra efficacy. Perfect for on-the-go, 24-7 skincare. Especially perfect for sharks that never stop swimming. Oh, it's nice. Second is pressed serum. This is a new category in beauty that combines the concentration of a serum and the comforting hydration of a moisturizer. So this multitasker is packed with shaga mushroom extract, which is anti-aging. Oh, it feels funny. It's like oh, it's a halfway like... between a gel and a cream. Yeah, it's exactly. weird. So last but not least, this is the next generation sea kelp sheet mask. As you may have heard, sheet masks are on fire in the U.S., and you might have seen the cotton <laughs> yeah, I sheet masks. Of course! <laughs> <laughs> so, sharks, we would love for you to join us in our journey to making the world more beautiful and glow, and glow with, with us. clear, ladies, you don't make these products. You source them in Korea and you bring exactly. them to the United States. Exactly. We're an e-retailer, yes. You're essentially a distributor. So our business is in two verticals. One is the e-commerce site, where we curate the natural beauty skincare products oh, from curator. Korea. We curate them based on our expertise. We have 20 plus years of combined experience in the world's largest beauty company, L'Oreal. You have 20 plus years? Combined. Combined. So you must have huge sales because you're putting a value in your business of over $4 million. So Let's hear about those sales. Last year, we opened Glow Recipe in November. For the first two months, our revenue was $3,000. 2015, year to date, we're at $550,000. Wow. And we're projected to do $1 million by the end of this year. So Sarah, all those sales are online. So half of that comes from our e-commerce site, where we curate the products. The second is where we act as a brand incubator. And we you are charge site, them for that service? Yes, we share the revenue with the, uh, the brands. But how do people know this? I've never heard of it before. Of course. And so a big part of our platform is to not only curate, but also educate. We have an extremely detailed site with very detailed instructions, usage, even video. Our main focus right now is really robustly growing our YouTube channel. Um, we think how, many video... subscribers, how many subscribers do you So right now our subscriber base is still around 1,000 because we have just started. But our cumulative views are 200,000 right now. Yeah, that's not, really, that's not really a legit number, though, right? Everybody we just started, right. though. Why is Korea hot? of beauty products. It's just hyperspeed innovation. The market is so competitive locally. The CEO of Estee Lauder likened Korean's beauty influence to the influence of Paris in fashion. How many SKUs do you have? How much inventory do you have? So right now we have 110 SKUs. Yeah. Okay, so that's where your cash is going then, right? Because if new products are coming out all the time, yes. your, your inventory is very much at risk. We don't have any slow moving goods right now. Everything is cycling through well, so fast. Until the fast. next one comes, right? If Korea is so, in, so much innovation, why wouldn't large retailers that make billions of dollars in sales in cosmetics not have those in their stores? So Sephora or Target actually carries a few brands. Not a lot, they've just started. So they're competitors now. They're competitors in a way, but they actually come to us to seek innovation trends and ideas. So you're thinking you're consultants for this industry in, in the United States. We're thinking that we're the thought and trend leaders when it comes to K-beauty in the U.S. Exactly. You don't have the scale that your competitors, the retailers, have. Well, why course, can't, why can't they hire some great talent? Well, anybody can do it. I mean, anybody could be a distributor. Yeah, but how many Sarah and Christine's are there out there? Though? Thank exactly. you, Mark. Thank you. <laughs> we also we provide education and translation. Not all distributors do that. You know, the, the, the one sector 
The one industry that's maintained its margins for a hundred years is the cosmetic business. Yes. Yes. I'm just choking on this valuation. Okay, I too. Well, you digest that. Let me speak if you don't mind. <laughs> I love the distributor space because you're a middleman. It's cheaper. You can grow faster. But your numbers are nuts. You should come in cheaper and offer a lot more stock. I think. Would you be willing to consider that valuation for a higher equity share? Well, a lot of. I'd have to ask a lot of stock. How much? I guess I'd give you 425 for 40 percent. <laughs> Barbara's not crazy because I was going to offer you 425 for 50 percent. I th I think you guys are the real deal. Uh, you're smart, you have credibility, you've been in the industry. It's a pure execution business, so I gotta buy you. I'll make a bet on two of you, but not at 10%. I'll give you the 425,000 for 30%. I think the business is worth roughly a million dollars today. But well, we're projected to do $1 million just in our revenue this year. Next year, our projection is over 3 million. And in the next three years, it's The key word there is project. Well, let me you tell you that? what I think. Okay. Sure. Yeah. I've been in the beauty retail industry for a very long time. It's a great business, but it's a very competitive business, as you know. Absolutely. One of the most brutal, right? So for me, it's not the right investment. So I'm out. Thank you, Lori. Thank you. Guys, you haven't gotten very far with digital content, and that's one of the we reasons you're here. We have a long way to go. Right. Not. You haven't done bubkiss yet. But that's where the viral opportunity should come up. We really need your help, actually. We'd love to work with you because you have that expertise in the digital space. Christine, what is the maximum amount of equity you'd be willing to part with for 425000 Maybe we can get to an answer very quickly. Because nobody's willing to give you the deal at 10%. Well, Mark might. No, I went, Mark. Do, I went to a 10 Well, what would you do, Mark? Yeah, yeah, we'd we'd love to, to hear from you, Mark. <laughs> I don't know enough. I don't know enough what I don't know. Right? Well, that's well, the problem. I like you. Yeah, really. You have Barbara, who offered you 425 for 40%. You have Robert, who offered you 425 for 30%. Mine? And Kevin, what did you offer? Well, I also want a premium for who I am, Mr. Wonderful. So I'm asking for an extra 10% because I am Mr. Wonderful. 425 for 50%. And Mark, so you know if that you, you could lose any too. one of those offers any minute now. I mean, as you're talking, they could drop out. I'm so, usually so decisive in what I see, and I just don't know. I mean, I work with a lot of Korean companies, so I'm thinking, okay, there's an angle there, but I just don't know what I don't know in this particular case, so I'm out. Okay, Christine. okay now. So, Robert, would you be willing to consider... 18. 18%. Christine, would you do it at 25? Robert, would you do it at 22.5? If it's worth 25, it's worth 22.5. I've come down. I think that's fair. I'd love to be involved with you. I would definitely do it at 25. Robert and Mark, if you would come together at 25, uh -huh. we would be willing to take the offer. Guess they don't like us. If you want another shark, then the amount of equity's got to go up because it's not enough. I'm happy to do a deal alone, 425,000 for 25 percent. I don't think I need another shark. I've got the tech if that's what you're looking for. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm just talking to Korea and we won't understand. <laughs> <laughs> yes, thank you. <laughs> we like to Congratulations. We really yeah. appreciate it. Thank you, thank you so much, Robert. Yeah, thank you. Good job. Thank you. So, Sharks, we wanted to just briefly tell you thank you in Korean. Kamsida. Kamsida. Yeah. How do I say screw you, Kevin, in Korean? Oh, no. Please, don't be rude. Congratulations, guys. Very nice, girl. Thank you. 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 Thank you.